Well, my name is Barbara. I'm uh, raising a, I have a nine-year-old son uh, who has Asperger, and he is actually my brother's grandson that I'm raising. Uh, he was perfectly normal when we got him. When I got him, I've had him since he was seven weeks old. Uh, we had no problems. It wasn't until he was uh, about 18 months that we started developing all the hassles. As well as being Asperger, he also has um, severe celiac. In the beginning, I was having major problems with Kyler because he constantly hit and kicked everybody, teachers included. It didn't make any difference to him who it was. Um, especially if a teacher was pregnant, then she was more fair game to be, to be kicked and hit. So they always had to have somebody to protect the teacher. Uh, we never went, um, the first couple of years of school, we were, I was there at the school picking him up anywhere from uh, one to three times a week, if not more. Uh, it was just one constant thing. He had been suspended from school several times for his behavior. Uh, we kept continuing, but we were still having this major problem where he finally eased up on the teachers, but he was still continuing to hit and kick all of the students if they even came near him or said the wrong thing to him. Uh, I was just at my wit's end. I didn't know what to do because he also carried this behavior through at home. Uh, refused to do anything you told him, and if he decided that he wasn't eating something, that was it. And it was just major temper tantrums, and uh, he'd even start attacking me as well. Uh, in the last little while since I've met Steve, and uh, we have had a complete change of um, attitude and behavior. We have gone for over three months with only one phone call and I have not had to pick him up from school at all. Uh, the, even the vice principal who is trained in uh, dealing with Asperger has commented to me on how drastic a change there has been in my son and that they are just so thrilled to see this. Uh, this is also carried on at home as well. We are having very little problems. Uh, we have rules and regulations in effect and certain punishments that are posted and he knows what they are and he is following through on them. Uh, I've only had him attack me once and since then, since the rules have been posted, that has even stopped now. So the change is just wonderful to see. As well as the change at, at home and at school, uh, my family have noticed a tremendous change in him as well, and they are all very glad to be around him now, and nobody has to worry about their, whether they're going to get attacked or not anymore. Um, but the, uh, he wants to be with the family, and he wants to take part in a lot of activities now, which was he would not do before. We have seen also a difference in, in my son with uh, his classmates because now he wants to participate with them, he wants to play with them, and uh, he wants to make more friends. This has been a major difficulty up till now because of his social problems and now he is asking to make more friends and he is spending more time playing with the kids after school and even on recess. Before I started meeting with Steve, Kyler did not want to cooperate on any chores. He did not want to do anything if he could get out of it and it would take hours before he would finally give in and do it. Um, one of the things he was required to do was to help with uh, dishes, like drying some of the non-breakable stuff, silverware, cups, things like this. Uh, now he willingly does that. In fact, some, several times he has said, it's okay, I'll dry all of the dishes for you tonight, which has been a wonderful change. He is responsible for sweeping up his room and keeping it clean. 
which I'm seeing a tremendous improvement in that, um, making the bed, and he is supposed to be sweeping the floor and keeping his cl toys cleaned up. We are both having a bit of a problem with that because I have a tendency not to do the same. So um, he is more active, wants to help more. He will even help in the kitchen making things um, if you require it. So yes, there has been an absolute tremendous turnaround at home and out as well. The beginnings of it was very stressful trying to raise him because we could not guarantee any behavior. Uh, it didn't matter whether he was out at, or at home. Um, he would, if he felt like it, he just let loose. Uh, you did not want to take him near a store or um, go to other certain places because you could guarantee that there would be a major tantrum. Now, um, especially with the rules in place, the stress level has dropped uh, considerably because he now knows what is expected of him and most of the time he does follow through. There are still some problems which will continue to happen, but uh, especially in the grocery store, you tell him some of the things that you need from the shelves and that has tremendously changed his behavior because he goes and looks for them and picks them up. Uh, so going out now is a pleasure. I don't mind taking him to restaurants because I can guarantee that he will behave himself there. And we are now able to do a lot more things uh, with him. We even take him to Home Depot for the children's craft area um, once a month and I have no problems at all. His academic um, achievements in school have improved too. Before he used to uh, get the occasional A, it was B's and C's with some B's. Now he has uh, improved so that he is getting more high A's with some B's, um, the occasional C, but he has also completed uh, two tests in school recently with perfect marks. The teachers are just absolutely amazed at the change. I would recommend this program to, to anybody else because it has changed my life around completely. Now I, um, I make the rules and I follow through on them. I don't go wishy-washy and change my mind part way through when he starts throwing a temper tantrum. And now because the rules are in place and are written down where he can see them, he follows them and he even goes to the, um, the cupboard where they're written and checks them to make sure. And if I haven't followed through on the punishment, he tells me that this is what I'm supposed to do and goes and follows through on, if he's supposed to lose some toys for something, he goes he goes to his toys, picks up the ones he's supposed to leave, and hands them to me. 